Mark Cameron is up next on CMT's Big in a Small Town. Mark, yeah, you look a little familiar to me. I, I sense the Tim McGraw thing. Have you ever had that before? <laughs> ever heard it? <laughs> Often, yeah, I get that once in a while for some reason. I I'm not sure why, but uh, it happens. Is that the look you're going for today? <laughs> <laughs> I was hoping for my look today. That's what I was hoping for. Well, that's a good look. What, show, uh, what song have you chosen for us today? Uh, I'm doing original today off a new album that I just put together. Name? So Name of the song? It's called uh, It Still Hurts. All right, well, I'm going to send you off. Good luck. Thank Go you, get him. Thanks. Mark's recent album, Just the Way You Like It, was produced by Gordy Sampson. Mark, welcome. Hi, Casey. How are you? Excellent. It's good to see you again, my you friend. You and you, too. Now, any added pressure you feel because this is your own backyard? And what, by the way, what a backyard it is. <laughs> it's beautiful, isn't <laughs> yeah, it? Yeah, absolutely. No, not much pressure today. Good luck. Mark Cameron. And I'm actually an owner-operator at CN Transportation. I drive the big rigs. That's what I do. I've been doing it for 14 years now. I love every minute of it. So I was driving through Dartmouth one day and, and saw a sign for a singing contest and um, told my wife about it. And I had always been singing in the house, and uh, she really pressured me to do it and said, you know, I think people would love your voice, love your singing, and you should go for it. So that's probably the first time um, singing in public was actually in a singing contest. So I don't think you could ever get more pressure put on yourself than to just jump into a singing contest first crack. I was a um, karaoke star season one, and since then I kept plugging away at everything and got to go to Nashville and do an album and everything and uh, funded it myself just to, you know, make it happen. I, I love the big crowds. I find um, anytime we're on stage and, you know, there's thousands of people there, you, t you, you tend to feed from that, not only me, but the whole band, you know. Uh, um, everyone just becomes one. But we'll still go out and play, you know, play in a bar or whatever for fun and, you know, play some cover tunes and, you know, just kind of get a party going and, and go with it. I mean, we're East Coasters after all, right? I like to think that I have a unique sound. I always try to find my own voice and, you know, get your own sound together and, and I think I've found that now. You know, I just figure I keep digging, and every year it's been snowballing more and more. So, you know, this is where I'm at now. I'm I'm ready for that next level. Now I woke up in a heartbroken haze this morning from a dream I probably woke you back. And in the fury of the moment, I reached out for your hand, knocked over a half empty whiskey glass. Welcome to another day of fighting to get over What I just can't get over The hands of time that take me time to heal And the world keeps turning no matter how I feel I've been trying to live without for so long now Do you think I'd be used to it? She still finds me in all this noise. I've got no choice. I die just a little. I cry just a little bit. It still hurts. It still hurts. Nicely done. Thank you. Awesome. Nicely done. I love that song, by the way. I, 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 can, I can already hear that song, full production, on radio, live, and people singing to the chorus. So such a strong song, great performance. Congratulations. Thank you. Awesome. Thank you, Casey. Thank you. I think you're awesome. Thank you. Um, you've got the whole package. It doesn't make sense to me that you're, you don't already have 18 videos on TMT. Like, you, <laughs> you know, you are the real deal. Um, that's a great song. There are some amazing lines in that song. Yeah. Holy, I could hear there's an opportunity in that song for you to really even just go a little bit further, you know, even melodically. Um, by the end of the song, like, I've, I've got all those key melodies and, and lyrics there. They're, they've already, you've already, you've already hooked the fish. So, like, <laughs> go hook the shark. So, Davnit said, you hook, the, you hook the fish, you just gotta hook the shark. Coming from someone uh, as successful as her, what does that mean to you? Um, but, well, actually, it's, it's, I don't think there's ever an end what you can do with a song. So I kind of I, I do get what she's what she means where she's coming from with that. So it's a uh, it's it's a matter of experimenting with it. So if you're already hooked with it, then yeah, you may as well just go for the big one. So I, I get it. I get what she meant.
Mark Cameron. What a voice. Mm -hmm. He's just, I mean, I don't know. He's, he sat down and I was like, hmm, haven't I see, already seen you yep. on TV or yep. already heard you on the radio? He's, right. he's got, he's got that thing. Like he's got it down pat. I thought he actually wrote that song. Right. Like he sold that to yeah. me. Like I really thought he wrote those words. And that is a special gift. You don't have to write your own songs. But if you're not going to write your own songs, you better be selling it like, <laughs> Make it sound like, like you it's did. your own song. Yeah. I really, I w it wasn't until I was told that yeah. he didn't write that song. I absolutely believed he wrote that song.